Grace, what are you doing? You look like that guy on Third Avenue that tried to sell me his toothbrush. I just want to have my speech ready for when my mom gets here. I'm not going to let her run my life anymore. No more fix-ups. Grace, look, I'm sorry your mother causes you so much pain and embarrassment, but you've got to look at it this way. It's incredibly entertaining for me. <laughs> Does that help at all? Well, I know you don't understand these things because you have a normal, repressed, passive-aggressive, panty-wearing mother. <laughs> but do you think maybe you could be just a teeny bit supportive? Okay, I'm sorry. Support can be beautiful. I'm right here if you need an assist. I feel good. I feel calm. I feel ready. Can we go? Oh, too late. The mothership has landed. 76 trombones led the big parade with 110 hornets close behind. Mom, Mom, you do realize that parade is only in your head. Bobby, you are, as always, a vision. Well, if you were any more delicious, I'd have to spread you on a cracker right here. Oh. <laughs> that was really nice for me. <laughs> that was my favorite daughter. <laughs> She's not really my favorite. <laughs> I say that to all my girls. It makes them feel special. <laughs> uh, so, Mom, how's the music man going? Dad said it opens next week. Well, excuse me, it's music person. <laughs> I'm starring as Professor Carol Hill. <laughs> well, if it's half as good as your performance as Millie Lohman in Death of a Salesperson, you can... <laughs> I'm so excited about this match. You know, Andy and Grace went to camp together, Will. Yes, I heard. Woodchuck number two. Oh, mm -hmm. <laughs> he was good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's here, he's here. Andy! Look, we're over here, dear. Hi. Hello, doll. <laughs> you remember Grace? Yeah, hey, Andy. Grace. <laughs> Hi. Hi. This, is, this is Will. Hey, Hello. Andy, nice to meet you. Sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down. So, so last week, Andy's mother called me. Oh, she mom, was telling mom, me all no, about... no, I, I, I've got to interrupt you because there, there's something I want to say. And Andy, believe me, this has absolutely nothing to do with you. <laughs> Since the dawn of time, <laughs> parents and children have woven an uneasy rug with the twin strands of codependence and independence. Move it along, Grace. I'm in my late 40s. <laughs> okay, okay, Mom. What, 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 I, what I'm trying to say to you is that... Andy, I think you're a really great guy. I think you're a really great girl. Grace. Mom, no, let me finish. Look, how many times do we have to go through this? I'm sure that Andy is a really great guy, but but clearly he's not for me. That's right. Andy's here to meet Will. <laughs> oh. Well, ain't that a kick in the head? <laughs> Will you excuse us a moment, Grace? Can I see you over by the chutney bar? I don't really like chutney. It's not about the chutney. <laughs> I am not getting fixed up by your mother. I'm sorry. I know this is so embarrassing for you, but 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 look at it this way. It's incredibly entertaining for me. <laughs> I am not doing it, Grace. That's okay? fine. I totally understand. But but just just one thing. What? You have to. What? You'll tell my mom how bad it is. She'll believe you because, well, you didn't come out of her. Don't do it. And then and then she will finally realize what a bad matchmaker she is, and she will stop fixing me up. Grace. I... Oh please, 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 please. Clearly, I'm not going to win this argument. Okay, one day. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> Besides, I, I may get to answer the age-old question. What's that? How much wood would a woodchuck chuck? chuck? <laughs>